Have you ever heard the phrase, if you don't have any friends that are realtors, then you don't have any friends? Well, there's more truth to that than you might think. The number from the National Association of Realtors latest report is going to shock you. In 2020, the numbers of licensed realtors reached almost one and a half million in total. That's up from a million just eight years ago. Now listen to this. There's over 38 million people in California and over 211,000 realtors, the second highest in the nation only trailing to Florida. That means there's a realtor for every 180 people statewide. <laughs> there are literally crawling out of the woodwork. If someone crawls out of the woodwork, they appear suddenly. You might not have seen them for a long time and probably don't want to. Let's have some more fun with these numbers. In Santa Clara County, there's a population of over 1.9 million people, which would mean that there are almost 11,000 realtors in just this county. In 2021, there were just over 21,000 sales in this county, so that equates to less than two sales per agent per year. So, are more realtors good for a more competitive industry, or does the oversaturation lead to less experience and training overall, meaning more liability to the consumer? As we really think about this, how much does an agent invest in training, improvement, and quality marketing if they're making 25 to 30K a year? Which, by the way, would be less than a full-time job as a McDonald's employee on minimum wage. So ask yourself, when you're gonna make one of the largest and most impactful financial decisions of your life, <laughs> Would you like some fries with that? <laughs> Would you like fries with your house? <laughs> Thanks for digesting this today. Again, I'm Shannon Ellison with the Walker Team of Ontario, here to educate and navigate, not speculate and fabricate.